Battle Cats update 10.6 starts off with a language selection screen. I'm tempted to try out my little bit of German learning, but ich würde nicht so gut darauf sein. Ja. And if you thought that the downloading of data and the loading screens were gone, unfortunately, you're wrong. I'm wrong. I'm, I'm sad. My inquiry code has changed. I mean, obviously I'm not going to show you, but it's different. And there's also some game things to accept. Ah, conduct an act called Bad YouTuber. Ha, ah, they'll never find me out. You can help Pinos get your account back. Probably useful. Certify you're over 16, if you are. And let them stalk you over the internet. Rare ticket for there being an update, of course. Absolutely fantastic. We got multi-language support, as it was noted at the very start of the game. And they're giving us stickers for that. Isn't that absolutely lovely? As you might expect with any new update, there are some more Uncanny Legend stages. This time, bringing with it a whole sub-chapter full of surge bases. Now, guess who gets to be smug that they're nowhere near that? Ignore Rich Cat and imagine in its place the digging units, because this update gives a true form to every single one of those. What a lot of love given to those units. Talent time, as if she needed any. Cyborg Cat now has some talents, increasing its chance to survive a lethal strike by 5% for every upgrade, giving it to the immune to... Immune to the Battle Cats community? <laughs> Resist freeze, defense buff, and attack buff. Oh heck. In and amongst the Ubers, Cat Machine now has some talents to gain the freeze ability. Pretty fantastic. Immune to knockback, equally fantastic. A little bit more move speed. A defense buff, fantastic. And perhaps a less useful attack buff, depending on what you're using it for. Cat Machine, for me anyway, came right into significance, loads, and then kind of faded out of it again. Seems quite nice to have some talents put on it, to maybe bring it back a little bit into the meta. Admittedly, a meta that I know absolutely nothing about. Finally, also somewhere that's not here, Sea Maiden Ruri gains some abilities to target Relic, get Curse Immunity, Resist slow, and the health and attack buffs you perhaps come to expect. Sea Maiden Ruri. All right. Cat combos, and again, something I can't show you, but them digging units have filled up some brand new combos. Given the update a sense of digging identity, I would dig it a little more if I could actually represent these changes in any way. Huzzah, Hazam! User rank rewards have been added! Who'd have thought it? We're now up to rewards for 14,100 with the amazing rewards of cat size, fair enough, rare ticket, alright, <laughs> and some bricks. And finally, I would love nothing more than to continue to pretend they don't exist because they are terrible stages, but in the interest of news truthfulness and you getting your fill on what's in the update, Baron stages have had a quite significant addition to them, which unfortunately makes them somewhat useful. Now, at the end of completing them, here is one such Baron stage, you are given a platinum fragment a brand new item which, if pieced together of nine alike pieces, becomes a platinum ticket for your own pleasure. Ladies and gentlemen, no longer pay to win for platinum tickets. The cost? You have to lose your sanity and any will to live you might have had negotiating through what are still terrible ideas for stages. Looks like I'm gonna have to abstain from shiny things for the foreseeable future. Well, that's version 10.6 for you. If you want to see about any more other updates, there's a whole playlist full of them. Thumbs up, hey. <laughs> like the video. <laughs> Don't like the video. Respect yourself and make your own choices. Don't let YouTubers tell you what to do. All right, see you later.